In 1858, a French engineer, Aimé Thomé de Gamon, arrived in England with a plan for a 21-mile tunnel under the English Channel. He said that it would be possible to build a platform in the center of the channel. This platform would serve as a port and a railway station. The tunnel would be well ventilated if tall chimneys were built above sea level. In 1860, a better plan was put forward by an Englishman, William Lowe. He suggested that a double railway tunnel should be built. This would solve the problem of ventilation, for if a train entered this tunnel, it would draw in fresh air behind it. Forty-two years later, a tunnel was actually begun. If, at the time, the British had not feared invasion, it would have been completed. The world had to wait almost another hundred years for the Channel Tunnel. It was officially opened on March the 7th, 1994, finally connecting Britain to the European continent.